Hello everyone, welcome back to MacTech 40 and today we will see the, about my interview experience in BEL and the post is trainee engineer okay and uh, before we start let me tell you the basics about the pre-requirement of this because uh, in trainee engineer you have to require at least uh, first class in your graduation with minimum one year of experience and if you have qualified the gate gate exam then there will be special weightage given to there are there is total 100 marks okay for your selection and this 85 marks is based on your academic performance and your experience and or if you qualified gate okay so then will it will be better your some extra marks will be provided to you from the 85 and 15 marks interview okay so this interview i have given few months back but uh, today i am going to make this video sorry for the delay and uh, so before starting the what are the questions they have asked and uh, let me tell you something uh, this interview is online okay and uh, some basic thing that you have to keep in the mind that wherever you are sitting in the room or any place so there shall be there should not be any person except you you only the in that room you should be only in that room no any other person okay and you have to ready with your uh, application number as well as one id proof okay and whatever table and chair that you are using so not anything like uh, if you have pasted anything on wall like equation or whatever thing so you have to cover up for one day okay because they uh, maybe tell you to show your surrounding that is uh, if you are not using any book or anything so on table whatever your books are there just uh, keep away from it okay and keep in a, in a shell or anything anywhere like uh, they cannot see and you you cannot also see okay the table will be clear only your laptop or tablet whatever you are using or mobile phone and uh, if you are using laptop then mobile phone yes you can use and just put in on the side not use that put on the side for the wi-fi connection or whatever but you should you should not use that mobile phone frequently the dressing should be uh, very neat and clean a formal un uh, dressing you'll be there okay and a stable internet connection with um earphones okay so that uh, there is no any interruption between there so this is the pre-requirement okay there should not be any uh, any person in the room and door should be closed no any surrounding noise okay so this is the uh, basic things that uh, you keep into mind okay so as my interview started so there are total five person one is the interview chairman that is called one from HR and there are three there are among them three I would I think uh, one uh, technical and two are the field person okay so let us start what are the questions they have asked so first question they have asked that is brief introduction and they have starting from graduation year why because uh, they want they do not want uh, anything from your childhood from where you born they have already your resume okay that you have uploaded uploaded so just uh, starting by a name and uh, in which year you have completed your btech from which branch okay and from then how much you have experience like if you have worked for one year or two year so whatever your experience that you have to tell them like for example from this year to this year for example 2019 to 2020 i have worked for this company and my role was this my designation was this okay and if you are currently doing that job then mention them i am current presently working in here in this company or organization and you have left then you have to tell that uh, in this year i have left the job and currently what you are doing okay that you have to mention briefly this is your basic introduction then they asked me college name not uh, any other they asked me my college name and from where i am living where i am giving the interview and where i am currently living so i have told them uh, what is my college name and uh, where i am living currently okay 
and uh, some uh, basic information like uh, how many siblings uh, are there in my family and what my father and mother are doing just one line information like my father is doing this and my mother is doing this and uh, i have siblings or not whatever you have you can tell so this is the basic two question from your basic personality okay and what some basic information about you and your background okay next uh, one person this first question brief introduction starting from your graduation year that has been asked by uh, interview chair person your college name and family background that has been asked by hr person and uh, the third question that is tell me the three subjects that you like most okay so i have given the answer uh, one of my favorite subject and i have, it is was my major domain and i have my work experience in that field and some specialties also my projects and all of that all are that so i have told refrigeration air conditioning fluid mechanics and theory of machines okay so these three subjects i told them and they ask for basic questions from rsc and uh, fluid mechanics like uh, what what are the basic components of uh, vcr cycle and uh, what is the psychrometry and uh, how to draw what are the lines there are basic and uh, what is the refrigeration process basic what is the difference between air conditioning and refrigeration the basic questions are there and in fluid mechanics they have asked what is the bernoulli equation what is the application what is the use of pitot tube that you have studied and in vortex motion what is the vortex motion why we are studying what is the use in real life okay so this kind of basic uh, question five four to five questions are there next uh, the another person that i asked about your past experience in job like uh, whatever what's your uh, designation and what your roles and responsibility in that job what you, you did for example if you're you are quality engineer so what is your role in quality particular that department what you are doing you are you are doing or you were doing if you are not left the job then you have to tell them and if any special uh, thing that you did and uh, organization appreciated you and given some uh, information about them like uh, in my experience i have worked in uh, some uh, kaizens i have done some kaizens are there so company given me some kaizen awards so i also mentioned them what are these kaizens i have done okay you what uh, those who are studying industrial engineering they know what is the kaizen and all the mechanical engineers are know what is the kaizen so hope you understand it what is what is the kaizen so this was a brief not a give answer in a particular manner whatever they ask just only information but in simple one line form like college name so my college name is this and if they ask what you are what how many siblings you have and what your father and what your parent mother doing so that that just that thing okay and in technical also until and unless they have asked in very can elaborative manner or some detail then and only give the answer otherwise it will be uh, not much interactive okay and they are very friendly all the interview panels are very friendly because uh, what happened actually suddenly uh, i was waiting for uh, interview room that uh, the panel will appear and suddenly appear and i was just like uh, what happened okay so they have seen me and just uh, tell me they keep relaxed and very they are very friendly if you hesitate somewhere then if you like that uh, sir i would like to think for this for four to five seconds so can you give me four five seconds or that yes they are giving they will give you okay so they are very friendly not any nothing worry about it so next question is what is the reason for leaving the job okay because i was not doing job at that time and now also i am not doing that job so what was the reason that i have left for the job so you have to tell the what is the your exact reason for doing a preparation or new job or anything whatever your reason that you have to told or if you not if you are working the still there so no problem and uh, the last question that is from again from hr personal that is would you like to do team work or individual work okay so i i told that what i like to do team work and those who like individual work they can also but you have to justify that why you would like to do team work okay so why i told them because in team 
everyone has some different skill okay and for doing particular job n number of skills are required if the work is uh, small then only one person can do if the task is small but they require uh, multiple skills and all the skills it is not necessary that you have so in your team that there is some other people that they can do the work same okay very easily like uh, the bharat electronics limited this is a defense psu okay so generally mechanical and electrical combined work so that is a chances that mechanical guy don't know the answer of some uh, electrical things an electrical guy then uh, can do that work very easily because his background is from that so that's why i have chosen for teamwork and uh, after that uh, they have said uh, thank you very much and it was nice and just uh, this interview was around uh, 20 25 minutes not more than that okay so this was the uh, my interview experience thank you for watching this video and in next video i will give you my another interview experience so guess which psu is there which organization was there i have given the interview few months back around one and a half months back okay so guess and comment me in the sec comment section uh, which psu okay i will though i am making a video going to make a video on that okay but just guess uh, which psu i have given okay it is not a psu that is you can say the organization yes you can say that organization okay so thank you very much for watching this video keep studying stay focused